It's a well-known marketing ploy. A brand sponsors a survey and shares the results. For maximum exposure, the wackier the survey, the better. So what can we learn from such sponsored studies of social behaviour? According to a survey by a British bread company, 29-year-olds have the most friends. Thanks to Durex, we know 30% of Americans fantasise about having sex on a plane, while 40% of British men would rather watch football than do the deed. According to the US Cotton Council, couples who sleep naked are happier, apparently because cotton sheets feel soft against the skin, encouraging openness between couples. Hotel chain Le Meridian revealed 78% of guests would take a morning coffee over a romp between the sheets. While lastminute.com.au discovered 30% of Australian women don't wear deodorant on holidays, yet also spend too much time getting ready. Website Miss Travel proved Aussie men are the hottest in the world, while healthcare provider HBF concluded half those Aussie men over 34 are overweight. According to RACQ, Queenslanders are frustrated by tailgating, but they can't be too frustrated because they're also having the most sex in the country. Just ask the Great Australian Sex Census, sponsored by Sexpo.